Have you finished your assignments? I finished the tasks, Professor. Well, well. Yes, sir, of course. Good. Ordinarily, I'd say it's not my concern either way. Talent and resolve are a potent combination. Thank you, Professor. D now, let's see how you fare with Defindo. Focus. Defindo can be dangerous if you're not paying attention. Hmm. Very good. It seems you have a grasp on it. I would encourage you once again to practice here in the classroom. For your sake, Let me and and it's a pleasure to have a student who actually heeds instruction. Defindo. As I mentioned earlier, Defindo can be versatile. Revelio. You're gonna regret coming here. I'd say you're right. Dismal's more the word for it. But you know what they say? Dark skies before a storm. Yeah, fair skies will be upon us soon. You'll see that I'm right. Mark my words. A witch in Felcroft. I was surprised how much jewelry she had. You're gonna regret coming here. Explosive! Uh, Incendio! Uh, uh, Explosive! Uh, Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Is the new Welcome back. I've arranged a special price on the broom upgrade for you. I truly appreciate all of your help. Nice doing business with you.
thanks for stopping by. I, I must tell you, Arthur Vogsmead's been by the shop asking about... Without the information you provided, my work would have taken twice as long. Thank you again. It may sound ambitious, but I've already begun work on another upgrade. More difficult... I wondered, would you be interested in joining forces again? There's another cause... If you were to test this first upgrade there, it may help me as I develop the next. Sounds as if you're really outdoing yourself. If I'm able to help, I... Thank you. I know this recent success... Report back as soon as you can, and we'll be off to the races. Off to the races, then. None of you You're the one who released Tabula. Just warming up. <laughs> oh, Revelio.
rebellion.
think they felt that in Revelio. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, a Hogwarts caretaker, at your sir. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we... Although I hear your visit... I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll... Oh, of course not. Uh, and from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to... Do you see that curious statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. Now, if you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Ooh, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed. Which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Uh, ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Someone, Rebellion. it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart, or shapeshifter, if you will, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. 
This one took the form of a demigod. A demigod? <gasps> yes! Terrifying creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are demigods. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on my name. Revelia. Some jackanape used a boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues did. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in a... Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I, I simply can't bring myself to go near them. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them, so uh, I can... I'd be glad to help you, Mr. Moon. Oh, I knew I could count. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Mm. You'll want to do that before wandering the town. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However will you get in? <laughs> Alahamora. But what about curfew? Curfew? Oh, tosh! I sense you're a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, and I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me. Uh, now, you'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hot... so no one claps eyes on you. This is a restricted area. Hello, Amora.
poorly, I'd say. Is that so? We're raising a generation of coddled cape flappers that can scarcely tell the difference between Arcanite and Asphodel. Imagine! 
Hello, Mr. Moon. Oh, goodness! it? Of course, I first suspected Peeves. He drove the previous caretaker, rancorous carp, to an early retirement with his intolerable buffoonery. But that does not explain the bogger in Oxmead, does it? No. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my... It's definitely intriguing. I'd like to help you solve... You, my friend, are a gentle person and a... Now, remember, the moons are only retrievable at night. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. Understood. I appreciate that. Oh, I, I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it so Rebellion. we can solve this. 